Well, first of all, I'd like to give Dayton a lot of credit. They're a top 25 team for a reason. They're, they're very, very skilled. They're big, they're long, they can shoot the three. Uh, they really rebounded the ball well in the second half. Uh, our team, I thought, did an outstanding job, obviously, in the first 20 minutes. And I told them, I said, hey, we, we beat them in the first 20, let's do it in the second. And two things I warned them about. One was Allie Malott coming alive in the second half, as well as Hoover. And right away, there goes 24 and 11, and they, they went at us in the second half. They also really hammered the glass pretty hard on us in the second half. And at one point, we hadn't had a rebound, and they were 7 of 7 from the floor. They came out on fire to start the second half. And we inched it back with 11 to go. We're only down 10, right where we needed to be. We got a little selfish at times, and that's disappointing. But again, a lot of the credit goes to Dayton. They're, they're just a very solid team, very well coached. But our team uh, really competed. I thought we did a nice job of handling pressure. They put the buzz on us, and we had 11 turnovers is all and 20 assists. So we shared the ball, got really good shots. I thought we were very unselfish in the first half. But we had a moment in the second half that uh, we started to beat ourselves. And those are things that we have to fix quickly because of a short turnaround with Rhode Island coming in here Wednesday. But I'm proud of my team. They battled, they battled with one of the teams, the conference's best. Um, you know, even Jim has said our team is getting better all the time. And uh, balanced scoring, I thought Sadie did a nice job for us off the bench. You know, when you get four double-figure scores with two in the 20s, that generally bodes well for you. And anytime we score over 70 points, it's a bonus. But you know, when you give up over 80, uh, your defense is certainly being tested. And that, again, has a lot to do with Dayton and their high-powered offense. Uh, but again, we'll see them again in a week at their place. Uh, we've got to fix a few things, but overall, I'm really pleased with our team's effort. Thought we battled. We came really believing that we could could beat a real a ranked team, and uh, we played well, really well in the first half. Um, not so well to start the second half. Made a run mid midway through, and just uh, did, couldn't cl close the door on them. But uh, again, uh, we'll get back to work. Uh, we'll have a short practice tomorrow, pretty much a walkthrough to get ready for Rhode Island as we play them in 48 hours um, here at home and. Hopefully we can sweep Rhode Island and, and get ready for VCU this weekend.